Hey there, it's your Age Line Advisor, Chris Arnold, and I have a um, just a quick tip for you on uh, checking your preferences in your profile on Avon.com. Uh, so first off, to do that, you go to where it says hi and your name, scroll over or hover over that, and then click on my profile. That will open up your profile. If you're on a mobile device, you're just looking for this little person icon here. And if you click on that, that will open your profile on a mobile device. Um, I've scrolled down a little bit already because at the top is some personal information um, that I don't necessarily want to display publicly. So scroll down. If you go down below where it shows your online store link, you'll start to get into where you can customize some of your preferences. Um, preferences around how Avon communicates with you. Um, also about like your visibility to people coming to Avon.com looking for a representative or looking for somebody to sign up under that sort of thing. Um, so just wanted to jump through these real, real quick and show you. And um, if I have a suggestion on, you know, what you should mark for your preferences, I will. The first one is your publicity permission. And um, that is just that um, says whether or not you give consent for Avon to um, to include you in any sort of publicity for like recognition and things like that, or if you attend an Avon event, um, if they're allowed to use you know your picture from the event and things like that. So um, you can check set that to yes or no. This one is a very important one. Um, now I know a lot of representatives maybe are not looking to expand their business to people they don't know or maybe aren't looking to build a team of representatives to help representatives get started and, and help them in, in their Avon journey. But this is where you go to set whether you want customers and recruits to be able to find you. So I'm already enrolled, enrolled so it will say change. Um, if you're not already enrolled, it'll, have, it'll say enroll. Um, but what you're setting in here is um, you can set which language that you do business in between English and Spanish, because those are the two um, that Avon has available for materials and websites and stuff. So this is not um, what language you want Avon to send you your materials in, but what language um, that you would communicate with customers in. Um, you can se select the dis distance that you're willing to service for face-to-face um, -face customers, for people that are looking for a representative um, for face-to-face, -face, and then you can save the changes for that. So this is both for customers, somebody who goes to Avon's website, uses the find a rep feature to look for a customer, but also if you are interested in getting in the leadership program or you ever think you might have somebody who's interested in joining Avon and they wanna join under you, this is also how new recruits can find you online. You have to opt into that so that they can see you. Um, it has the link to the customer and prospective representative referral program and how that works. You accept the terms to that and save your changes. So um, this is very, very important. Like I said, if you are interested in getting new customers through Avon.com, and I will say, you know, you're not going to get a ton of new customers through Avon.com, but this is also if one of your existing customers is looking for you and they go to Avon.com and they search by your last name and the state that you live in, this also ensures that they'll be able to find you that way. So this is so for any customer to be able to find you without having your direct online store link. Um, so very, very important one to set up. Um, if you haven't already, go ahead and record a little intro video um, that so that if um, customers are looking for a new representative or somebody is looking for a representative to join under as a representative, they can watch your little video and kind of get to know you and see if um, if they think that they will um, get along well with you, if you are the type of person that they would like to shop with or work with if they're going to sign up. Um, so you can add a little intro video there. Um, again, you know, if you're just doing this as, as a hobby or you only plan to sell to people that you know, then this is not as important. But if you are looking to build your business and find new customers, this can, I have had people that said, that they picked me as their representative or they picked me as the person that they wanted to join Avon under because of my video. So um, if that's something that like you, you don't know how to do it or you need some tips on what to say and things like that, absolutely reach out. I'm happy to help you with that. Communication preferences. This is a big one. So if you're not getting 
emails from Avon or you, you know, not getting all of the emails that you hear about and you feel like you might be missing out on information, you definitely want to go in here and check your communication preferences. Um, you'll get this little pop-up box when you click on it. I have mine set to receive all. Um, you can also change how often you want to receive messages or what type of messages you want to receive. As a representative, your customers can do this also, but as a representative, I believe you should be getting every single email that Avon sends out. I know it's a lot. Um, I can offer tips on how you can organize your inbox to make them easier to deal with if you need that. But you want to go in and make sure that you're missing those. You especially want to make sure that you're getting the emails about incentives um, because you don't want to miss out on those um, because you didn't get the, the email letting you know about it. So um, that's the, the communication preferences. Customer delivery options. Are you going to order um, offer if somebody finds you on Avon.com or somebody goes to your Avon website, you have two choices. You can offer them direct delivery only, which if you're looking to run your business online only, then you should probably have direct delivery only set. If you are willing to service customers in person and let them place an order through your website and market for representative delivery, which is when you then place the order and collect the payment and deliver the order, you would leave it set as both. Um, so cancel that because I don't want to change that. Um, your online store profile. This is another thing that you can put in um, that people can see when they're looking for a representative or looking for somebody to join Avon under. And this tells them a little bit about you and you know, all other things being equal, they're, you know, obviously the fact that I sing and I crochet and I like to play games with my family doesn't have anything to do with how good of an Avon lady I am. But if you also like singing or crocheting or like playing games with your family, we're probably going to get along well. We're probably gonna be like the same type of personalities and, and that will tell you if that's somebody that you want to do, um, to do business with. You can also come down here and choose from some pre-made uh, pre lists of different things. Um, I have marked my favorite categories because the two categories that I know the most about, I'm the most knowledgeable about, I enjoy selling the most, are skincare and makeup. So if a customer's looking for somebody interested in skincare and makeup, they might be more likely to choose me than somebody who maybe has um, fashion or jewelry or fragrance picked um, for something like that. Um, you can tell a little bit about your lifestyle, your interests, etc. And you can link your social media accounts so that these will show on your online store. When people go to your online store, they can also click through to your social media accounts. So you can set those up um, so that those links will be active on your online store. Um, so that's what I had. My, my little quick tip there, definitely go in and set your profile and um, make sure you've got those preferences um, set the way you want them to. And if you have any questions, absolutely reach out. I'm happy to help. Hope you guys are all having a great day and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.